Hey peeps, what's going on? Here is still in chapter two of the cat lady and uh, my last video I did with no commentary just to see if you like it better with commentary for me or without. Um, I'd love to get your feedback on what you like better. I can definitely do either one. It doesn't matter. But we are back and we're about to give her the red stuff and see what happens here um, since that's what we got from that weird spider looking thing in the last video and this girl's straight up crudete. Um yeah it's pretty nuts but here we go Alright, nope, I don't want to do that yet. I'm gonna give her... I've found the thing you asked me for, but are you absolutely certain it won't harm you? Don't be silly. Of course it won't. Fine. I hope you know what you're doing. Can I have your name band now, please? Yes. No matter what they say, I do keep my promises. What do they? You know what? It doesn't matter. Thank you for your help. So is my name being... Oh, it's Annie's now. Where's she going? Is she in there? Nope. Now to get rid of the nurse so we can get that discharge letter. I have an idea. Since you can flush the toilet and stuff and we have gloves, the only thing I can think of is to try to flood this toilet to get her away from the desk. It worked! Jess! Go me! That is awesome! Now to call the nurse. <laughs> Come here, you little winch. I don't like you. I wish I could slap you. Someone is coming. No needle sticks for me this time. Have you rang the bell? Is there an emergency? The toilet's blocked. What? Ah, oh, well, that's hardly an emergency. It is when you need to use it urgently, like I do. I see. Fine, I'll sort it out. Just give me a minute. She's such oh, a witch. the gloves, again! I guess I'll have to get my hands dirty since the cleaner's called in sick. <laughs> <laughs> Good. You deserve to get your hands dirty, winch. I don't like her. Alright, let's get this discharge note. And get the heck out of Dodge. I hope that one girl's okay, though. Sorry, ma'am, can't let you through. We'll need to see a discharge letter from your doctor first. Here. Are you happy now? Yes, that seems fine. Can I just check your name band to confirm that you are indeed Anne Burton? Oh, all right. I didn't realize you knew how to read. <laughs> there you go. Can I go now? Of course. Thank you, ma'am. We'll see you soon. What? No, you won't. Now get out of my way. It's a storage room door. It's locked. <clears throat> it 
it's a door to some office. It's locked. Go figure. Dime ward, maternity ward, exit. Uh oh. And you must be Susan <laughs> Ashworth. Um, well, perhaps I am. Do you mind if I ask you where you're heading to? I was just going for a little walk, stretch my legs, get some fresh air. Give it a rest. I'm not going anywhere. Miss Ashworth, please relax. There's been a mistake. You have been prescribed wrong medication. I apologize sincerely on behalf of my team and the hospital, but luckily we managed to spot it on time. On time? You have no idea what I've been through? Once again, I'm truly sorry. I promise no more drugs will be given to you. I personally guarantee you will have a good, peaceful sleep tonight, and you can be discharged in the morning. Why can't I go tonight? I want to go now! I'm really sorry, but we can't legally discharge suicidal patients without a full psychiatric assessment. It's too late for it now, but I promise we'll have a chat in my office first thing in the morning, okay? And then you can go home. Is that all right? I haven't really got much choice, have I? <laughs> 